Hello and welcome back. This is Dr. Jerry Cuomo. I'm, I'm now going through the polishing techniques that I uh, will use. Um, I like the Centrix uh, points. They work pretty well. They just give a nice surface buffing. Um, I'm going to you know, look around. Uh, the, you know, This tooth, number two, definitely has a fracture. So um, I'm kind of finished with that point. Now there's cups that you can get. I'm going to bring a cup in next. It's a, um, a gray color cup. It's the middle, uh, middle grit. Okay, so this is like medium. So I'm just kind of polishing like a profi cup. So I'm just coming in and polishing like that. So it's nice and soft and it gives a nice practice. Now you can use a bristle brush. You can use pumice. You can use uh, tin oxide. And there's a lot of things that you can use uh, to get this price. But, um, you know, for now, for this video, right now, we're going to end it with uh, the white color, which is the fine cup. Again, it's pretty flexible. Last thing I need to do. Okay. And just about done here. Almost finished. Just going to the last thing for our good patient. And we'll send some floss through there next. A little floss coming. And it snaps through nice. There we go. And uh, that's it. Those are nice restorations. Real happy with things. And um, we have the upper left quadrant to do next. We'll just take a quick peek at that. So we've got some more amalgams. Well, what I would do is, uh, if you want, maybe do a molar and a by first by um, first molar, and then maybe do second molar. I talk about maybe alternate too, so we maintain the the bite of the patient. I really don't want to do all four of these all at once. Um, I just feel it's a lot to do for any patient. So maybe just keep with keep with the same system. We'll do two at a time. You know, two large ones at a time would help. Okay, take care. See you next.